Downtown Nashville is all the buzz. The 2024 CMA Fest kicks off in less than 48 hours and around 90,000 fans are expected to fill the streets of downtown Nashville for this multi day festival. And I would not be surprised if it was more than that. Yep. Stephanie Langston, our CMA reporter over the years, takes us downtown for a look at how this year is shaping up. Well, road closures and stages are set from a Nissan Stadium all the way up Broadway, where the music will be kicking off here on the Riverfront stage early Thursday morning and continue throughout the day at stages like Hard Rock Cafe. And it's all for free with more than 300 artists throughout the CMA footprint. In addition to all the music, you can get that old fanfare experience and meet and greets at Music City Center, where Dolly might be taking the spotlight this year. So, I mean, certainly there's so much excitement about Dolly coming to be a part of our Fanfare X experience starting on Thursday, but we also have, you know, we wrap up in Music City Center on Sunday with Lainey Wilson, so Entertainer of the Year, one of the biggest artists in the format. And I think for local local viewers, one of the things to keep in mind is that there's still access points even if you don't have tickets to the stadium. So if you can come down to Music City Center and come for $10 a day and get to experience artists and signings and music um, or a 25-day, four-day pass. We have concerts back at Ascend Amphitheater this year for all th on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. And we have a few tickets left on Thursday night, not a lot. So I think, you know, and, and we also have the Hard Rock stage right behind us, not just during the daytime this year, but also at night. The stadium shows are ticketed and nearly sold out, but again, there are plenty of free stages and opportunities scattered around downtown. If you don't plan to join in on the fun, you can catch the CMA Fest concert special airing right here on ABC in June. And this year, Ashley McBride and Antioch native Jelly Roll will be your host. And I'm told that three hour special will feature more surprises and collaborations than ever before. And then, of course, we're going to have all your daily festival coverage right here on News 2. Reporting from downtown Nashville. Stephanie Langston, News 2. And News 2 is your place for all things CMA Fest. Go to our website, WKRN.com, to find road closure, safety tips, and the latest forecast, even a first-timer's guide. Just search the keyword CMA Fest.